Okay then, so tonight we're at the Britannia Europa Gatwick Lodge and Britannia Lodge. Uh, so this is where I'm staying tonight, but straight away as I'm outside, they're doing a bit of work, they're doing the place up. So they've got a new path in, they've got a slate as well. So I think Britannia are spending a bit of money from the outside anyway. It's certainly looking a bit more presentable than when I was here three months ago. Let's go and have a quick little walk around and I'll go and show you the room. restaurant just up there. You even got a free water station. And this is the, uh, the bar area. So everything's like Mediterranean themed. Um, what feels like I'm in Spain. I can tell it was quite nice at one point in time. Let's see the restaurant. Then just advertised it's a hotel all the way along where you can stay. All different ones which I've pretty much been to all these. <laughs> So they do a package here with parking, with it being so close to the airport, you can pay to park. Uh, well you pay for a hotel room and you get discounted parking, which is really good. Right then, so what we got for dinner tonight? We've got Carvery. It's not bad is it? So we've got a Carvery, there's a fish there, and a veggie option, desserts, I think you get salad bar as well. And a starter. Not bad really. Just walking down the corridors. Hopefully this video is a bit better for you guys. Hopefully the quality is much better than what it has been. Let me know in the comments below. If you like what you see today, uh, please give me a subscribe because it really helps the channel grow. Right then, so tonight I'm at the Britannia uh, Gatwick Europa Hotel. It's also the Britannia Lodge as well. So let's go and have a look around. So this is what you get tonight for £88. Now, I did book this earlier on today uh, and I've just noticed that the prices have actually dropped with it being last minute. Um, so they're actually now 69 However, I wasn't to know this when I booked it. And with it being half term, I thought uh, I'd better book something quick. So yeah, just a bit cheaper now, but I paid 88 so I've got a bit of an upgrade, so when she, I checked in she said I'll give you a better room, um, so that's good to see. Uh, now obviously I don't tell anyone I'm coming here prior, but so this is what you get, nice big room. I have stayed here before, so I know the beds are all comfortable, uh, pretty good. Pretty clean in here, it's had a recently new carpet. A couple of bedside tables there, uh, now they have got drawers in them, but I'm not really sure how are you going to open them the way that angle towards the bed another thing i don't really like here is this is not a switch for these lights you actually have to pull this tab so it's a bit crap uh, i have noticed an issue with the room straight away so you can't shut the curtains because they only go to there so you're left with this big gap in the middle but i will just sort that myself right then great to see we've got a bag stand straight away uh, we've got a TV, albeit a little small. You know, it's going to be pretty low down for when I'm watching that, but I'll make it work. Right then, so what else have we got? So there's a few marks here on the walls, but we've got some of the unsealed hangers. We've got a trouser press, uh, a pillow, but it's not in a bag, and uh, a blanket behind there as well. There was also an iron just down there on the floor. Right then, so we've got some extra towels, which is great to see. We've got cups facing the right way around, so they're, they're clean as well. Now, it's a classic casket every time. These are the kettle clean tonight. Let's have a look. Yeah, it is. Look at that. Bang on. You know, I never have a problem with Britannia kettles. They're always really clean. So, we've got the Britannia tea, as always, and the uh, coffee as well. I'm not, not a fan of the coffee, but it is what it is. 
Right then. So let's have a look around. Bathroom, pretty good actually. Uh, it's all themed like Spanish style in here. Um, there's the free soap and the towels as well. And then the shower, I've already stayed here before and I know it's good pressure. Uh, we're all pretty clean and that. You do get the shower gel on the wall and we've got a, a bath mat as well. So yeah, I'm more than happy at this. Although it's quite dated, uh, it is pretty good condition. Um, and it is certainly clean, so I'm happy. Right, it's quite a lot to see at this hotel, so let's go and have a walk around. Okay then, so this is actually where we booked to stay, in this Britannia Lodge. But uh, yeah, been upgraded to the uh, one where I'm at. Let's just have a look around the grounds though, it's absolutely massive. Um, so the good thing here is, it's cheap parking, so this is why it gets full. Obviously, with it being so close to Gatwick, it's full pretty much every night. So just looking at a sign on the wall there and all the letters have fell off. <laughs> it's not a good sign, is it? Okay, so this place does have a health club and a swimming pool and a jacuzzi and a gym. It's quite a bit, uh, but you do have to pay extra. I'm not going to film in there because it's not right. But it's just there to the left, hit to the right, sorry. Yeah, right, so these are the grounds. Got to stay to this pool, this pond even. Look at that, ugh. All green mouldy. But the last time I was here, a couple of these windows were boarded up, so I suppose they've tidied it up a bit. And all this was covered in crap, so. Yeah, looking a bit better, even though it's still a bit rough. So just through that door there is the pool. Uh, so the windows are blacked out so you can't see but yeah let's go see if we can get a shot inside what do you think okay yeah so it's up until seven o'clock tonight last entry uh, being seven sorry so up until eight then but look at this so all the way around this pool out oh, this pond even there's no railings to stop you falling in so if you've got kids, it's not good, is it? All you've got is just a sign telling you to be aware of it. I don't think that's going to stop your kids from falling in. Okay then, so last time I was here, all this place was all hanging and dirty, full of cigarette stumps up here. So that's all been done. There's new pipes all the way around, so you can tell something's happening. And they put new fences up. All this was all blocked off. They even got a, a fountain going and there's some lighting over there. So they're spending a bit of money doing the place up. It was full of scaffolding and now it's not. Yeah, not bad. So this is what we're talking about. 57.50 for a room and eight days parking. Or this price, 67.50 and 15 days parking. So you get to stay here and park. So let's go and walk to the room. So 57 quid and a week's parking, brilliant. See what I mean about the, the Mediterranean style. Okay, so the food's got a bit better. Turkey as well. And then chocolate cake and coffee and mandarin cake. Okay guys, so that was it today. So let me know in the comments below what you guys think. Would you stay here? Uh, and if you've not subscribed already, please consider doing so as it really helps the channel grow. I know it's a little bit cheaper than it was when I first booked it, but uh, I had to book it uh, just to know where I was going. But it is what it is. So let me know in the comments what you think guys. Until the next one.